friends. Today I am going to talk about the biggest project in Kabul, Jalalabad. Stay with us until the end of this video. This project is located in two provinces of Afghanistan, Sarubi, Kabul province, and Sark Rood, Nangarhar province. This geographical location is of strategic importance. By improving the condition of the roads, access to these areas will be facilitated. Increasing security and ease of transportation are other benefits of this project. The project is under the supervision and management of the Ministry's Projects Office, PMO. The PMO is responsible for project planning, execution, and monitoring. This office works in cooperation with various local and international institutions. The goal of the PMO is to ensure quality and accurate project timing. The type of activity includes the construction and asphalting of the provincial road. These activities are carried out to improve the road infrastructure. The use of new technologies in this project is very important. The ultimate goal is to increase road safety and efficiency. The length of the road is 140 kilometers and the width of the road is 11 meters. These dimensions have been chosen in order to improve the quality and efficiency of the roads. Proper road width reduces traffic and increases safety. The proper design and implementation of these dimensions is of particular importance. The project is financed by the Asian Development Bank. This bank helps to finance the project. Asian Development Bank has also played an important role in similar projects. Cooperation with this bank guarantees the provision of stable financial resources. The budget of the project has been allocated in 2016. This budget is allocated to cover various costs of the project. Timely provision of funds is of particular importance in the progress of the project. The cooperation of financial and government institutions is necessary in this field. The main goal of the project is to improve and asphalt the Kabul Jalalabad road with a length of approximately 140 kilometers. This road is one of the main highways of the country that connects the central provinces to the eastern provinces. With the completion of this project, the transportation situation will improve. Increasing safety and reducing travel time are other goals of the project. So far, 50 kilometers of the road has been completed and put into operation. These parts are made using modern technologies. The high quality of construction and asphalt is particularly important in this project. Local people have benefited from the improvement of road conditions. In addition, the next 35 kilometers is under renovation, 15% of which has been completed. These departments need careful monitoring and management. The cooperation of local and international institutions is necessary in completing these sectors. Improving the condition of these parts is of particular importance in the project. Regarding the remaining kilometers, it should be said that these sections are under procurement process and their contracts will be implemented soon. These processes require careful management and monitoring. The ultimate goal is to complete the project on time and with quality. The cooperation of different institutions is necessary in this field. This highway plays an important role in the trade between Afghanistan and Pakistan. Facilitating transportation between the two countries is of particular importance. Increasing trade and economic cooperation is one of the main goals of the project. Improving the condition of roads will increase people's satisfaction. The preservation and care of this road is of great importance in the economic growth of the country. Regular and timely maintenance of roads is particularly important. The cooperation of public and private institutions is necessary in this field. Improving the condition of roads will increase people's satisfaction. Completing this project can help improve transportation infrastructure and increase road safety. The use of modern technologies in the construction of asphalt is particularly important. Reducing traffic accidents and increasing safety are the main goals of the project. This project will increase people's satisfaction. One of the main challenges of the project is the timely and quality completion of the remaining sections. Security problems and regional instability can have a negative impact on the progress of the project. The cooperation of local and international institutions is necessary in this field. The ultimate goal is to complete the project on time and with quality. Security problems and regional instability can have a negative impact on the progress of the project. The cooperation of local and international institutions is essential in securing the project. Improving the security situation will increase the speed of project progress. 
these challenges require careful management and monitoring. This road can help reduce transportation costs and travel time between central and eastern provinces. Improving road infrastructure can help attract new investments in the region. Increasing trade and economic cooperation is one of the main benefits of the project. This project will increase people's satisfaction. Improving road infrastructure can help attract new investments in the region. New investments can cause the economic growth of the region. Increasing employment and economic opportunities is one of the main benefits of the project. Improving the condition of roads will increase people's satisfaction. This project can help to increase the access to educational and health services in Sarubi and Soar route areas. Improving road infrastructure will increase safety and reduce traffic accidents. Increasing people's satisfaction with public services is one of the main goals of the project. This project will increase social interactions. Improving road conditions can help reduce traffic accidents and increase public safety. Increasing road safety reduces casualties and damages. The cooperation of public and private institutions is necessary in this field. This project will increase people's satisfaction. Using modern technologies in asphalt and road construction can help reduce air and noise pollution. Proper road design can help protect natural resources and reduce negative environmental effects. Improving the environmental situation is one of the main goals of the project. The cooperation of environmental institutions is necessary in this field. Proper road design can help protect natural resources and reduce negative environmental effects. The cooperation of environmental institutions is necessary in this field. Improving the environmental situation will increase people's satisfaction. This project will increase environmental interactions. Improving transportation infrastructure can help promote cultural and social interactions between different provinces. Facilitating access to historical and tourist areas can help the tourism industry in the country. Increasing cultural interactions is one of the main goals of the project. This project will increase people's satisfaction. Facilitating access to historical and tourist areas can help the tourism industry in the country. An increase in tourism can increase the economic growth of the region. Improving the condition of the roads will increase the satisfaction of tourists. This project will increase cultural interactions. The Provincial Road Project Asphalt Sarubi to Soar Rood is an important and vital project to improve Afghanistan's transportation infrastructure. With the completion of this project, not only the condition of roads and transportation safety will be improved, but also new economic and social opportunities will be created for the people of these areas. Due to the importance of this project, comprehensive efforts to complete it on time and with quality are of particular importance. This project plays an important role in the economic and social development of the country. Thank you for watching.